Photography and Digital Imaging Technology degree is a BSc degree um, encompassing aspects of science, technical and creative um, parts of photography. teach practical photography and professional photography and video and um, lots of photo practice but we back it up with um, teaching about the underlying technology and science behind it. I chose to do this course because it was a bit different from all the other photography degrees as well. I mean there's loads. It's the only place where you could learn the science of photography. I wanted to have a, a technical understanding, even a scientific understanding. I wanted to learn something that was more academic and take on the science side and the, you know, learn more in depth about the camera itself. It's something that nobody else was going to have really. It was different from the general photography course. The the course began in the 1960s and originally it was, it was the first photographic degree in the UK. During the last 20 years photography has changed more than the 100 years before. There is a core uh, syllabus which remains the same, which is the theory of, of photographic science. However, uh, the methods and the technologies are very different. The new course has a real emphasis on um, professional practice. There are people teaching photography and they have a purely photographic background. Digital imaging, computing, engineering. We have image scientists um, who teach the science behind image making. What we call visual literacy, which is kind of understanding of images and their meaning. Forensic imaging in video uh, production. With colour management and, and things that are going to be really important to the industry in the future, I think. One of the unique things about this course is the range of subjects that we cover and there are some areas that we cover that you wouldn't find on other photography related courses. The ability to use photography and imaging to extend our limits of vision. To learn about infrared and UV and all the radiation and stuff, it was great. It was stuff I've never tried before and it was interesting and it, it was refreshing to do something new as opposed to just normal photography. And this course gives you like a, a toolkit of skills from across the um, imaging world. You never find that you die everything. Somebody will bring you along uh, a new job you think. I've not seen something quite like that before. So whether it's lighting a fingerprint or a footwear mark that's in a particularly difficult place, or whether it's on a curved surface which is really difficult to light and you can't get all of the mark in one. It just gives you that extra level of confidence that it doesn't matter what tomorrow's job throws at you, you're always going to have the knowledge and the skills that you need to deal with it. How to kind of manipulate the process and the equipment and the technologies in order to kind of get the best technical result. We look at things in a different way to other courses, I think, because we always try and um, make the link between the creative side of imaging and the way in which we look at images and the kind of scientific imaging side of imaging and the way things are formed. This course gives you such a wide um, range of knowledge. And there's so much variety on the course. Every day it always teaches me new things. And I really enjoyed it. I'm happy.